Ciao e benvenuto to another episode of Feast, where we show you some of Joburg's hottest restaurants. And today, Weni Lovo in Asahi, with an authentic Italian style restaurants that make pastas and linguine and all of that. And we're gonna eat on your behalf. And we actually have a special guest for you. So I'm ready to eat, let's go. Standing here with the head chef of Asagi, Luca Toni. Ciao. Ciao. How are you? <laughs> I'm fine, thank you. I'm fine, I'm fine. Bene, grazie. <laughs> Bene. <laughs> Can you tell us a little bit more of us about Asagi and, and what it was and what it is and what you guys make here? Exactly. Asagi is one Italian restaurant, original Italian restaurant. Uh, it's a family restaurant, very simple. It's uh, famous for the Simple dish, grandmother mm. is uh, very popular for uh, fresh pasta. Mm. That's awesome. Look, so, what are we gonna have today? Like, what do you have prepared for us? I don't know. I'm looking now. Uh, look for a prep one starter. I look uh, one or two dish pasta mm -hmm. and uh, one fresh dish pasta. One more popular pasta is a spaghetti pescatura. Okay. Yeah, not the main cause. Uh, very popular is a now is a cotoletta milanese. Okay. It's a big step deal with the fry. Yeah. It's one of the more popular. Remember, it's one restaurant and more client in this shop is a Jewish people. Oh, okay. And one of the more popular meat is a veal. Oh, okay. So they like veal more. Exactly. I'm looking forward to eat. Uh, I'm, I just want to taste the food now. Luca, grazie. Prego. <laughs> Let's eat. All right. Got a special guest. Uh, you might know him as Simon. You might know him as, um, as TRT. But I know him as Nyani Sotet. Welcome to Feast, my man. Thank you very much. Uh, I've always wanted to eat with somebody and I always thought you would be the best person to eat with since you're such a character, so, uh, yeah. I think there's good and bad with eating with me. Uh, <laughs> you eat with me, you, you, it'll be fun, but uh, you might end up not getting as much food as you wish. Speaking of food, this is what Asagi has done for us. Uh, they've taken care of us. This is a zucchini fritters, I think it is. Uh -huh, I think so. Uh, we, we got some wine as well. You see, they take care of us here. This is this is fantastic. Oh man, yes, it's beautiful. <laughs> so, uh, oh yeah, I was saying, you know, these zucchini fritters. Like, I'm ready to go in. Let's go in, dog. Yeah, there's a fork right there. I'm just gonna go in, like. I'm gonna be a gentleman about it. Side plate. Side plate. Damn, son. Are they dope? Yeah, like, I always wondered like what zucchinis, I, I've never really had. Yeah, like I never really went in with zucchinis before, but this is like... I have a young prayer. <laughs> gonna pray. I'm sorry I didn't pray. This thing has been smelling so good, I've been waiting to tuck in, bro. Like... Fantinel Pinot Grigio. Pinot Grigio. Little Wayne has a line, so that way he uses Pinot Grigio. Does he? Yes. You would know, music producer. Listen to this guy. But anyway, ish, man, no, I feel like we're going to finish this, this thing. This, this thing is, is amazing now. Back to the food, yeah. <laughs> we, we were supposed to just taste, which is um, what we just learned, uh, what asaggi means. And asaggi means taste. Exactly. In, in Italian. And we're, we're here tasting, but they have amazing big main course meals, mm. um, of which uh, Luca just told us about. Uh, I love Luca. This is killing us. Oh man, this is fire, guys. Yo, I feel like we should move on to the next dish because... Mm. Okay, so here we are. I forgot what the name was, but Luca explained it to us. Uh, it said it's brinjal though, so I can eat it. It's vegetarian. This guy doesn't like meat. No, man, it's not that... It... Never mind. Meat Me? story is a long hey. story for me. Go Me, I'm not wasting time. time. Me, I'm not wasting time, guys. Delete, Peter. Delete. Mm. 
Okay. I feel like I gotta take a moment to take it in before I eat it. In the feast kitchen, when I was cooking with Leander, the dish she made tasted like it had meat in it. This is exactly the exact same thing. It tastes like there's meat, but there's no meat, guys. Damn, son, this is fire. You will silent dance for it. <laughs> this is fire. Yeah. What episode we are? Yeah, Instagram. yeah. About to delete. What? What's yeah. this? This is the ravioli. We're about to hit the ravioli. Woo! Oh wait, this one's my fork. Yeah. Okay, so we're gonna have this ravioli. Uh, you saw Luca kind of tell us about it. So we're gonna tuck in and, 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 and let you know how it tastes. I'm ready. This dog. time I'm going in first. <laughs> Actually, taste it and let me know what you think. I can get it, it's bad. Too much. Too much. I love, I love the ravioli. This is amazing. Asparagus brie lasagna. So this is, is one uh, very famous dish for a side. It's oh, meat. okay. No, no. no. It's uh, asparagus. asparagus. Fresh asparagus okay. with brie cheese, with white sauce and parmesan yeah. cheese. Very simple. Awesome. That's for you. You can... You can awesome. No, I'm waiting that for the meat. You know, Luca's going to take care of me with the meat. So this is the asparagus lasagna. So because Nyani is the Mr. Vegetarian, Mr. Mr. I don't eat meat. Yep. Let him go in and give us his expert opinion. Go in, Baba. So, I haven't been eating meat for a year. Yeah. Hell yeah, dog, it's a vegetarian. I'm a vegetarian and, and, and moments like this make it worth it. So, I'm Damn, pretty sorry. sure. I'm, I'm sure. Judging by the four meals before. <laughs> what did I say? Oh? What did I say? Okay, we can toast to that. Let's, let's toast to this wonderful lasagna toast. Mm. Mm. But let me see. Me, guys, you know me. I'll pretty much eat anything. I love meat. That's my vibe. But, but let's see. You're gonna love it, man. Okay, let's see. Let's see. It's down. You don't put this aside. Mm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. is is quite right. This is so good. Mm -hmm. Homemade pasta, guys. Homemade pasta. This is what homemade pasta is all about. I'm a, I'm a gentleman. And people, when they taste this food, they go in and then they mm. And I look forward to it. Um, yeah, guys. This is why you need to come here. They take care of you. This is a family style restaurant. Bring your wife, bring your girlfriend, bring your side chick, bring your side nigga, bring your auntie, bring your uncle, bring your... Uh, I bring my auntie. Bring, bring your cousins, bring everybody. Because why? Shit is fucking good. And the people here at Asaji will take care of you, dog. This dish apparently turns gentlemen into savages. Exactly. You so stop if you eating think, like this. Yeah. You eat like this. You go in. You go in. Pen. Wow, wow, wow. I look forward to it. So, yeah, let's, who's, who's going in first? You. See, I want to go in right here. Oh, you see that juice? They are stripping on the table. Mm, 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 mm. See that juice I'm right there? I'm not afraid of I'm not afraid of Nah, guys. Wow. Crab, dog. Okay. Wow. Okay. It's not. Hmm. No, like crab has like, like this. Yeah, it has that kind of like prone flavor. But then, you know what I love about what Luca did? What? Luca came through with the sauce, dog. Luca came through with the sauce. So it doesn't just taste like any normal, like... So we decided that we're not even going to try and be gentlemen about this. We're going in mm. hands first. Hands, Baba. You don't eat with your hands. You're joking. Mate. You're playing. It's Let me actually say this. Say it. If you want to be like a nyani and sit and eat with me, guess what? You can. 
all you gotta do is subscribe to our channel or follow us on social media. That's all you gotta do. That's all you gotta do. And tell us why you love food. And you could be sitting right here. Yes. Eating amazing food. Yes. That place is like a salad. Yes. So do we're it. Dessert as well. And Lucas here to describe the desserts. What's the what's the dessert? Allora, this is a classic dessert for a saggi. Is a dolce della nonna. It's a very simple dessert. It's a amaretti biscuit for Italy. It's going in. A, one special Italian wine, aromatic with the egg, is a marsala uovo, is coming from Sicilia, Sicily. You organize a zabaglione, a cream, walnut, or for Italy or for California, and uh, Belgian chocolate. Belgian chocolate. Very simple, but very nice. You try, you taste, you talk. Oh man, this this looks amazing. This looks amazing. <laughs> I don't know if it's a good thing or a bad thing that I'm planning to bring my 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 girlfriend here. Wow, it's amazing. Is it like it's very popular? Uh, is it like nuts? Mm -hmm. Walnuts, uh, walnuts, walnuts. Yeah, here in South Africa, you use a pecan nut. Like it's a very sweet. It's not the same. Mm. It's a cheap uh, pecan. Nut. Walnuts is very sweet. Yeah, this is a bignet. I'm organizing the bignet with Italian custard. I'm organized for the moment because say you put the custard inside, the vinaigre is coming very soft. Custard in the center. I'm organizing another one for you, no problem. <laughs> wow. Um, what can I say? That was just another experience. We were so well taken care of. Yep. And you got to see like the family environment firsthand. Like how well we were taken care of, how much we feel at home here. And even when you try the food, like there's such a like a homely feeling about it. Like it feels like it's made with love. And you got to see the chef himself and you see how passionate he is about everything that he does. And this is why you guys need to come here and experience this because it's such an amazing place that you need to experience, not alone, but with people you love. And it's definitely, it's definitely, it's not, it's not a, a, a one of those things that you just want to go away having your experience by yourself. It's, it's such an amazing experience that you have to share it with somebody. So yeah, definitely got to say that this was a great pick for today's episode. Uh, Asaji is cultural, pays a lot of attention to detail and, and the love and the passion that goes to the food. You, you can taste it. That's beautiful and it's been such an honor to wow. be here. Thank you for inviting me on uh, today's episode of that. Peace. It's only a pleasure. And like I said to you earlier, if you want to be like a nyani and be on the show, or even if you want to like get an opportunity to win like a lunch or a dinner with whoever you want to go for to, at any of the places we've been to, then all you got to do is like, you got to share the video or subscribe I'm or me. follow us I'm me. on social media. It's so simple. Just all you have to do is just press a button, just click, 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 and done. And you could be standing right here with me sharing a wonderful meal. But until next time, I've been Brian Mushongera. This has been Inyani Sotete. And thank you to the good people at Asaji. We're out of here. Follow them on Instagram, Asaji. Let's just go, let's just, let's just go home. Let's go.